Yes! No beasts, no murlocs. Let's go patches. But yeah, I want to play a bit better than uh, I did uh, today. I don't know. I think I played a little bit too much Battlegrounds in the past few days. And my brain is not functioning. But I'll make it work. Um, Wait, let me think. If I buy Suave on one and play it, does it curve out so that I can... Uh... This is the best play. Um, you hero power on patches on one if you don't get a pirate offer. It's super simple to you. So, I'll explain the patches curve as best as I can. Let me put the bands first and run a prediction for my gambling lovers. Murlocs, me mechs and beasts are banned. One moment, please. Now you're level. Okay, your objective as patches is tough and free ASAP Rocky. Because on Tavern 3 you have uh, the best pirate known to mankind. Obviously you want Hogar and you want Eliza. But before Hogar and Eliza you want to do some shenanigans that include Captain and that include uh, the 4 part. Okay, if you are not offered pirates on turn 1, you hero power. If you hero power into Scallywag obviously you play it. If you hero power into the Swabi you don't play it. If you don't play it on the first fight then you level up play it. If you're offered both in the shop. Again if you're offered Scallywag you buy it and play it. If you're offered the Swabi... You buy it and hold it. Now, hero power first, and then buy the Swabi and play. It. And now next turn, leveling is gonna cost four, and my hero power costs two. Two plus four is six. We level to tower three on six G. Obviously, it would have been better if the pirate I hero powered was a two drop. Either the two six or the captain would offer us a lot of tempo. Well needed tempo. If you somehow hit a triple, you discover a free drop. So, I would want to discover three fives and sixes, depending on when we are in the game. On this turn, I would take a free drop. Starting with next turn, if I'm offered a triple, I think I'll try to take it uh, into a five. But it depends. For example, if Scallywag triples, I have to take a four. Otherwise, I take too much damage. That's good. It's not the best, but it's solid. Okay, next turn. <laughs> you want to get offered two pirates in one roll so you can double buy hero power. Realistically, it won't happen. So what you can do is like buy a pirate, hero power. You have two rolls. No tracker on screen. I'll add it now. I don't know why, why tracker is wrong. Okay, it's working now. I don't know for how long, so let's enjoy it while it lasts. Can't you also straight level? Maybe you straight level to 4 if you not offer 2 pirates. That's probably better actually. It's risky though. Really Every single time you level to 4. Okay, this guy level to 4 as well, fuck it. But it's Eudora and he finished the dig. Top 8 curve. I mean, I'm not that strong. But even if I lose to him, how much damage can I take? Yeah, of course, we fucking high roll. He discovered like the be one of the best 4 ups you can possibly get. To give him tempo. Fucking high roller, dude. Like, when I play that... Oh my god, dude. I'm taking 10? Fucking high roller, dude. Best 4 and best 5. Oh, it's okay. okay, we got Salty Luther. Salty like me. Can you mold more? I think I can, actually, yes. I don't like Bonker. I guess Ellie's maybe you want to open on Salty, but I don't know actually. Okay. Two K chat giving a RDU advice. Well, the advice was good, and probably people in chat are higher rank than me, at least some. I'm not in a position to go to 5. We have to sit and roll for pirates. Hire 
That's a very good pirate. That's what I would have picked. I ha! You want a tussle? I think I'll buff their game scenario. You want a tussle? Yeah, Gibbs Nuggle is M MVP. Playtime has nothing to do with MMR, it's all about winning. To some extent. Like if somebody plays a game per week, they can be the best in the world, they're not gonna make it high. But a lot of people are lying to themselves if they say that it's only about playtime. If you look at the consistency of people getting super high ranks in battle runs, it's pretty crazy. Like, if luck was involved, I would be winning more. <laughs> I kid you not, dude. With how much I'm playing. You take it now. Eliza now would be sweet. Hey, a triple. Here's your reward. Both is probably better than Dawn. Yeah, for sure. Imagine if Salty was always getting buffed even when you summon minions from the boat. That would be too OP though. Because boat is very up. Playing 2-3 hours and I shuttle between 7 and 8 KMMR. Your minions really pulled their weight. I mean that's pretty good. That one might make all the difference. I don't know if I want another captain. I want Hogar. I think we sell the Scallywag. Without Eliza, they are not that good. That'll do some damage. Yes. Let's go like this. Thank you, Minder, for the 21 months. I appreciate it. I also appreciate the tips that you've been giving me. The advice on how to play better. Like, now I feel like if I'm playing calculated and calmly... I uh win more. Getting Eliza from the ball helps. Yep. Oh, it's okay. We all hit some bumps now and then. Oh ho, you're moving up in the world. Now we also have a real life version. Wow, wow, we woo.
I think I'll go Genie to defend. I didn't like that one either. Here's a goal for the trouble. Maybe I should have buffed Eliza with one of the triples. I think that would be better. That would have been better. Everyone's ah, a couple of small mistakes here. Maybe I should have sold the Grabber as well. Keep some other pirate in hand. Or just commit to playing it earlier. Leo Rat blows though. Hogar doesn't need, to, doesn't need to survive the fight. I mean, the idea of buffing Hogar is that he's a permanent unit, not that he needs to survive the fight. And he's also a perfect unit to just put up front. But yeah, I think you prioritize buffing Lazy before you buff Hogar or anybody else to that, to that extent. Yeah, now I'm going to 6 for sure. Your minions really pulled their not afraid of Goof. I think I want to just sit. What do you need on 6? So first of all, 6 gives you uh, one more minion per roll. So higher chance to get any minion that you want. Higher chance to get the pirate. But straight for 6 is I want Eliza. Maybe Amalgadon. It's no max lobby. We want to just go strong and kill people. Just max strength, kill everybody. That's my plan. If you freeze double selfless on tavern, then you shouldn't level on to 6. I don't level to 6 to freeze double selfless. It would be a waste, a big one. Okay, I have so much- oh shit. I mean, buffing Eliza wouldn't help her survive that. But it still sucks when it, whenever it happens. Okay, he's not still carrying his weight. Wow! I bet Goof says oof. Top three. Quick lobby, I told you. Oh my god. You're down a minion and up a goal. Oh shit, I should have frost Hogar. Yes! Thank you, Ramsos, for the six months. And the Scallywag. Scallywag is useless. Hogar was more important. Why not Charlie for one turn? Because plus one plus one in my board is close to worthless. I'm just wasting time playing Charlie. Sure, you could go for it because you have free win anyways. I don't think it matters. Nice work out there. Keep up the pressure. I'm over the pirate overload. Eliza, where are you, baby? That's a great play. I can't wait to see this shake out.
gonna need a I don't have gold to triple that. I didn't like that one either. Here's a gold for the trouble. So the thing is, one Hogar doesn't go that crazy, Watch out. but these stairs are still pretty crazy. I shouldn't even bother with his Divine Shield, right? Because he's not gonna have Divine... I mean, he could taunt his... He could taunt his DS. Yeah, he could taunt Divine Shield. Was my biggest pirate ever? Um, I don't know actually. I do not know. One off. You're good at this. Nice. the strongest but it'll fight hard a good tactical choice now you start buying selflesses ha you want to talk i love catching some way Like that one either. Here's a gold for the Do I go Baron or Selfless? I feel like Selfless. Baron gives me one more Scallywag. Nothing selfless is probably better, yeah. Except mice. And then we kick Eliza next turn. Try to triple the Selfless while getting money. Let's see if you can stay on top. I don't need Scally. Yeah, but I want a minion that I can also sell. Right? I got lucky that I had that I didn't have to waste an attack. Into this guy. I had a chance to win. Big stats. Now he's just the Quillbore I'm all Quillbor menagerie Your guy. Really their we just go selfless. Uh selfless, I mean ghoul. Ghoul is the best until you triple selfless. You got this. You're way ahead. <laughs> 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 
He tried to scam. Cute. I told you Patches is a first place hero. 